let's talk about a YouTube. So I was talking about how I see a lot of people on social media got all these followers and none of them really support you. If you post that on your page that you need some support, put that on your page that you need some support or something that you trying to bury somebody and there's a funeral, do a GoFundMe or something. See how many people really support you. You got what, 300,000 followers, 800,000 followers and 99% is fake. Or they ain't really trying to support you. Or they got an excuse why they didn't, but they've been following you and messaging you, right? When it comes to a real life issue, you can't really reach out to no Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. That ain't the real world. A lot of y'all need to realize that. That ain't the real world. Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. How many pictures you can put up? I'll put it up for business purposes. If I ain't making no money off of it, don't mean nothing to me. Old people trying to find you on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter that you left in high school and junior high school and kindergarten and they track you down and see you on IG or Facebook, send you out a message. They the same person, just older, or you ain't seen them in a while. That's all that really means. Are they going to help you and support you in what you're trying to do in life? That's, that's what counts, right? Especially when you get older. You want to get some real supporters. You need some support. So you reach out to some of these people on your social media platform and none of them really come through, but one, one or two of them or a short amount. You got, what, 100,000, 80,000 followers and friends and them ain't real friends. That's computer friends. Now, this pandemic got people, you know, feeling some type of way on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and even by email, just being on the computer. So I say that to say this, that ain't the real world on the computer, baby. So now it's really coming up, what, no computers, but that's how it is now. They control everything, the music, everything, movies, all on computer. Pretty soon it's going to be computers replacing people inside your Walmart and your stores, your grocery stores, selling you tennis shoes, computers. Or they're gonna have a way where you can download and pick it up. It's gonna be waiting for you outside. Scan this, scan your ID, scan that. It ain't gonna be a real person, so it's gonna be putting people out of work. Like and share my videos, your boy Black Nate DiBiase, 523. Peace out, you know I'm unstoppable, baby.